Hey guys, welcome back to another video. More today, today I'm gonna to be showing you how to install my data pack specifically, but you can install any data pack onto two server hosts. We got Atronos and we have Minehub here. And I'm gonna show you how to install data packs. I'm specifically gonna download mine. In this video, a lot of you have been requesting that, kind of confused. So uh, I'm hopefully you just get that out of the way. So yeah, I hope this helps and anyway, let's just get right into it. All right, so the first thing you wanna do is get your data pack, or if you've already gotten it, you, you can just skip this step. But if you're, but this is if you're getting mine. So if you go to my video, my desktop data pack video, and it's just right here, it's Google Drive. Then once you're here, all you need to do is click this download button. Okay, so we're gonna be starting with Atronos here. And Atronos is the easiest one to add, as you can directly uh, download and upload worlds. So all you need to do, you're in your server here, you go to worlds, come on, okay? And we have a world here. Now, I haven't generated mine yet. All right, so you gotta make sure your server is off. And once you got your world, you just wanna click on download. So pull it up here, just go into your world, under the world here, go to data packs, then go back to this downloads folder, drag it into here, it'll copy it, it'll compress everything, you know, do all that stuff. Anyway, once it's in there, all you have to do is go back to Atronos, upload, zip archive, and then you can open up Anyways, I'm an idiot. I clicked on the data pack. Anyway, you gotta click on your world. Sorry about that. And then it's gonna upload everything. It's gonna be pretty cool. And then you're done. You can go to your server. You can start it. Yeah, no, now I gotta wait for this. Oh my gosh. Okay, so now we gotta go into creative. Uh, remember your server has to be 1.15 or higher. 1.15 isn't exactly tested. So you basically want to go data pack list and uh, right there, file, death, death swap, roll, and we can do. Anyway, as you can see, they're all here. You can uh, you can do some stuff, set up, you know, pretty cool. Anyway, yeah. Okay, so we're gonna be doing mine hut now. It's a lot more difficult. So just follow every, 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 every step. Anyway, go to file manager. You may need to, you know, activate your server first. Um, but you want to go into your world that you want to, you know, put it in. Uh, so you want to click on your world. I'm going to do a 15 more world. You want to go into data packs. And you're going to want to create a new folder. And this folder is going to be called, I don't know, just whatever you want. Uh, death swap data pack i don't you know just yeah okay so now you're gonna go to your uh your the data pack you know death swap data pack dot zip. now if you're doing the big data pack you may you need to basically add every single one of these files in every single one of these folders that's basically what we're doing since you can't directly upload zip files or folders so we just have to keep creating a ton so you're going to go into the file we've created and then you're going to create another one called data then go into that it's we're basically just kind of copying this and then death swap this one you can actually name whatever you want but you have to but it has the last one has to be data death that we're gonna go in here now advancements and functions if you don't care about the advancement that i put in here it's just one u1 advancement you don't really have to put that in it's not required but i'm gonna do it anyway advancements you have to spell it correctly so if i spell it wrong i'm an idiot and functions all right so we're gonna go into the advancements folder. 
and we gotta upload this so we're going to upload files now before we select the file we have to go back to our downloads you could have done this earlier or you can do this now but we're going to extract all we're going to click on extract now we have a folder as you can see and now we can upload that so we're going to select files go through here advancements we're going to upload this all right now we have that we're going to functions to upload um, there you go go back functions now you could do control a or you could do this select them all click them all at once click open and then upload it's gonna upload all of them cool and we're gonna go back sorry if i'm going a little bit fast you can you know pause whenever you like yeah, we got everything so now all that we're gonna do is we're gonna go into our desktop data pad and we're gonna go right here back to where your data folder is I'm gonna upload, if I can click it, we're gonna upload the pack.mc meta. Upload that, you're done. You got it, you can restart your server, make sure you do that, it's pretty important. Come on, hurry up, there we go. So we're in our world, I did that completely wrong. And do a fresh data pack, this. There it is. File just swap data pack world. And we can go look at our functions. They're all there. We can do set again. So yeah, that that's how you could do it on Minehut and Atronos. I would recommend Atronos over Minehut, but if you already have a Minehut server, you know you could do that. I hope you learned something. I hope it's helped you.